Okay, we're going to look at how to record a video, um, or, or I'm sorry, record a PowerPoint presentation and also be able to look at your notes. Apparently it's something that's not available in PowerPoint 2007 and I noticed that there were a lot of people that were asking about it and the answer always was, I uh, can't do it. So, uh, and I was looking for the same thing. I'm trying to record a PowerPoint presentation for a Udemy class that I'm going to teach and it turns out that I couldn't do it. Okay, sorry about that. I had to go find my PowerPoint presentation for this computer and uh, so here it is and you want to go to slideshow and you want to record narration here are my notes. I, this is what I want to say while I'm recording. And of course, this is what I want to do. <laughs> I won't be saying click. <laughs> but, um, so if I go to record narration, where are my notes? I can't see them. And, uh, I mean, that's ridiculous. And then to have to uh, be able to click and look at your slide and then look down at your notes and say my other solution was to, um, to re was to, um, print it out and I look at it and, uh, it's just too much. So, here's what you do. Now, let me see if I can minimize this and get rid of this. Um, I will provide a link below the video for a little ho auto hotkey program called uh, Keep It On Top. Now all it is is uh, off the work of someone who had already uh, written one called Always On Top. However, when I went to download it, um, just check the download and make sure that I've been using it for a while but just to make sure the download was still there and working properly and stuff um, I got a uh, Google Chrome thing saying that it was an infected file and it would not download it and um, uh, so and then the guy who wrote it it was also on his website but then uh, in Dropbox but then when I went to it it said it was no longer there so he um, he told he said what it was. It was just a one-line piece of code uh, in Auto Hotkey. Now I've compiled it here. I don't know if you can see um, there with at the bottom right. Keep keep it on top. Dot exe. That's what I named it. And so I will provide the link in the video below. What you'll do is download it, and um, you just double-click on it, and it'll bring it up and probably put it on your desktop um, or wherever you sto sold, wherever you stored it. Sorry. And then, if you want to record your um, video, if your PowerPoint, um, and what I, of course, what you have to do here is you have to um, copy this into Notepad and uh, and that's the link for the uh, Dropbox that I'll include below the video but you have to uh, slide by slide uh, include the notes and uh, copy and paste so yes it is an extra step it's a few extra steps actually but it sure is but once you get it set up it sure is better than the alternative these are my notes and so what I did was I stretched it out and I also I uh, used to have a notepad in a larger um, font and so what I did was select all and um, and I made it a smaller font. I made it 10. I think I, I used to have 14 but I made it 10 and I'll show you why in just a second. And uh, then I brought this down here and you do want word wrap because you want to be able to see <laughs> the end and now mine is off the end of this particular video but it is still on my screen I have a very wide screen so I don't want to put that on there and uh, this you can put as high or as low as you can tolerate I don't necessarily need to see the whole thing I'm I'm reading off of here but I do want to see kind of what's going on on my screen here and so I'm gonna click this Actually, I'm sorry. 
the instruction for the all keep it on top is very simple control space and so I just did that and now it's on top and then if you don't want it on top anymore do control space again and it it ba goes back to normal so control space record narration hello and you do all this and there is your notes right there on the bottom and uh, you can move this around um, as much as you want and you are going to have probably have to scroll unless you have very short notes <laughs> or make it really really tiny print which you can but the reason I I made the font less was because um, for some reason this shows up in a very uh, or enlarged and stretched out and uh, and it makes the font look larger than it actually is and so you can make it smaller in the notepad and um, anyway this is going to be my Udemy course look it up on Udemy that's U-D-E-M-Y dot com little free advertisement there it'll be ready in I don't know a couple of days um, this is the middle of August right now and so you can record I'm actually recording apparently on this and um, um, and here are my notes and this is where I click and then I click and I finish it and I do have to scroll down here and look to make sure I got the very bottom sentence in there and um, I can still go back here and click and then there's my PowerPoint and yeah I'm still looking at my notes and so I hope that's helpful it's a it's a workaround from um, PowerPoint's refusal to let people look at their notes while they're recording and uh, anyway and then let people know that you've seen this video if um, if it's been helpful to you and they have want the same solution okay thank you bye